Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Silent Core and welcome back to my Red Dead series. This is the series where I keep you up to date with all the latest news and updates in Red Dead, or usually the lack of them. But today, as always, I'll be going over today's Tuesday update, letting you know everything that you need to know. So the theme this week is the naturalist role, and if you're wondering if this is the second week we've had a naturalist bonus, you would be right on that. Last week we had the kind of rabbit bonus as a fun little bonus for Easter, but this week we have a bonus on all naturalist. So to go over with what Rockstar said, enjoy the wonders of nature this week in Red Dead Online, and make the most of your next excursion with a complimentary cure package featuring three potent herbivore bait, three potent predator bait, and three special lake lures for all players. And those yet to answer Mother Nature's call can take 5 gold bars off the retail cost of the Naturalist Sample Kit. So that is your free login bonus this week in Red Dead Online, and for those who haven't purchased the Naturalist role, you can save 5 gold bars off that. Next up, whether they are fresh faced or seasoned, all Naturalists will take home double the cash and XP on all sample sales this week. Sampling any legendary animal will land you 100 sedative varmint rifle rounds and 5 animal revivers, which to sedate and rejuvenate your targets. Now you can actually make some pretty fast XP to level up your character in game with the naturalist samples and especially this week with the bonus, but it is going to be a pretty boring activity, I'm sure most of you guys will agree. Should your animal documentation equipment need an upgrade, make sure to complete a round of wildlife photographer, there's plenty of them for, to choose from throughout the day, you'll receive an offer for 40% off the cost of the advanced camera if you do. Bring your pelts in to Gus McMillan for him to turn into garments and trinkets alike, and if you craft any item at Gus's store this week, you'll get an offer good for half of any outfit below rank 15. I don't know about you guys, but is anyone else really tired of just getting these coupon rewards as if they're actually good rewards in-game? I feel like Rockstar have been giving us so many of these just useless coupons as if they're actual good rewards. Next up there are some angler bonuses. Toss your lure, kick up your feet and enjoy the benefits of a day on the lake. There's times to Red Dead Online cash and XP on all free roam fishing challenges, which are occurring more frequently this week. Plus visiting the butcher to offload any fish will earn you 50% extra cash on all sales. Unless you're a fishing fanatic, I honestly wouldn't waste your time on this one guys. Next up we've got the discounts to go over this week. These are all naturalist and also fishing themed this week. So we have 30% off all Harriet's tonics. 30% off novice and promising naturalist items, 30% off all items in Gus's store if you want to grab any garments or any legendary animal um, equipment, we've got 30% off the elephant rifle, and 40% off the fishing rod, all fishing lures, and all hats. If you haven't already bought them, I would recommend stocking up on all your fishing lures while they are 40% off, since some of those do cost gold. And that, guys, is pretty much it for this week. It's going to be a very short video, but April and May, I would expect them to be very, very dry months. We're not going to have much content. Pretty much all we have to look forward to in the next couple of months, at the very most, I would uh, suspect, would be a set of three new Telegram missions, similar to what we had um, a couple of months ago. But yeah, Outlaw Pass number five is going to be taking us all the way to the end of May, so we can expect, you know, a new DLC to happen sometime June 1st or onwards. For these next two months, I will be continuing to cover the update every Tuesday, but do let me know guys in the comments if there's any other type of videos or content you want me to make uh, to keep things interesting. I did post another game I've been playing over the weekend, Outriders, I posted 10 tips and tricks for that game if you guys might be interested. But yeah, let me know what you guys are interested in, I want to keep uploading content while also covering Red Dead, even when it's just not too much is happening in the game. If you are looking for some new people to play with in-game, don't forget to join my Discord channel, it's free. We have a channel for every platform so you can find people to match up and I'm pretty active in the Discord too if you ever want to chat with me in the general chat section or throw some memes in there. But yeah, that's all for me, don't forget to subscribe for more Red Dead content and I'll catch you guys in the next video.